there are growing complaints online in terms of vendors not accepting cards from Jamaica in terms of purchases and online transaction. Has this been brought to the attention of Minister Green and um, are you in dialogue with the Finance Ministry and the parties to remedy the situation? A lot of this has to do with current practices that have evolved in our society, such as scamming and other online fraud. There is also issues related to correspondent banking, which is also a part of some of the challenges that we face as a society. Um, being grey listed in particular jurisdictions has really limited, in many cases, the ability of Jamaicans to do transactions internationally. But I think Jamaicans need to understand that the actions of our, some of our countrymen will have impacts on our personal lives. I personally have seen some of the conversations online. Persons are not able to pay using their credit card with particular merchants. A lot of these things have to do with trust. How much do people trust the systems and the, and the persons from particular jurisdictions? Who they're doing business with and I think as a society we have to work harder to rebuild the trust that people have for us by not promoting endorsing or engaging in particular activities that may cause other countries and jurisdictions to start looking at us um, in a particular way